We're back with Sonia Ross from the Associated Press, where we're now broadcasting our shows. Thanks to our executive, uh, Liz Loki. We're glad to be here in your backyard, Sonia. And Clarence Page, a uh, Pulitzer Prize winning uh, commentator, writing commentary, that is, collective bargaining. We've mm -hmm. heard all sides. Where do you come down uh, on this issue, Clarence? Well, without collective bargaining, a union is just a social organization. So uh, uh, the governor, uh, Governor Walker of Wisconsin, has hit at the very core of what unions are about. So I, I don't think either side is being uh, totally candid about this. I think uh, uh, unions have to recognize that, that times have changed and that in many ways uh, they have been standing in the way of, of, of innovation. I, I think of teachers unions in particular. Uh, who, who I love teachers. I don't like teachers unions. <laughs> the, way, the way they have behaved uh, insofar as uh, oftentimes getting, getting in, in the way of accountability uh, for teachers and, and this has served to to discourage good teachers and reward the mediocre the mediocre ones and that really needs to change. I don't think the right to collective bargaining should be taken away from public employee unions however that's overreaching on the governor's part uh, and uh, I think this could backfire against him but you know this kind of, this is a conversation we Americans need to have from time to time. Uh, Sonia, I, I want to stay with this a minute. Do, do you think that um, you know, many Americans believe um, that public employees are paid and live more lavishly than private sector employees. And many Americans are saying that the unions are no more than a taxpayer-funded organization, and they should care, share, put in more of the lion's share of the costs. Your thoughts? About unions? Uh, or about, about, oh. about what's going on with, oh, see, that's, the reason we're sitting here talking about unions is because of what's going on, irrespective of unions, and that is a money crunch, yes. where you get right down to yes. budgets that have to be balanced, mm -hmm. resource revenue that has to come in from somewhere. States are states are really struggling with that burden, and they're looking for answers. That problem transcends unions, but right now all of it is, is playing out on a stage that threw the unions right into the, the middle as the, you know, the mm -hmm. starring They become character. the faceplate of the all. Right. Yes. Right. Fair uh, or unfair. Fairly or unfairly. Right. And it's easy to lose sight of the broader problem and the broader picture when you start to get down to fixating on mechanics. Um, the mechanics of a union, the mechanics of way state budgets are put together, real, you know, visceral painful monetary problems that are playing out. I well, mean, let me interrupt you here a minute. So do you believe that what you're hearing that if the union...